what advice would you give to business owners that are in Ian's position if they are looking to put someone in a construction manager role or a general construction manager role or whatever title I'm going to give you? It's a tough one because the, it feels like the margins are so tight when you are that person that's going from you know, being a six-person operation to potentially growing to 12 and you've got so much pressure on that. You know, the quotes that go out, like if, if I make a mistake or we make a mistake, it's fairly costly and that's not my money, but you take that responsibility. So it's sort of hard to say to that person because there's still so many business owners out there that aren't like Ian and can hand off that responsibility. Find the right person that you think is going to drive the, the culture and in, entrust them with the power to make mistakes. It's going to cost you business a little bit of money in the short term. I think long term being able to give you that flexibility in your lifestyle and I think it's, you know, very important.